Welcome back to my channel. I to see you on my hold on one second. There we go. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I uploaded. Um, also, I never got to upload or post or made a video last week. But, yeah. I never got to make a video about last My car. God damn it, or whatever. Anyway. Because I, I, I was at my boyfriend's house. I was gonna film, but I forgot my camera. Like my phone. I normally I record on my phone, right? It doesn't wanna work. It wouldn't let me record. But some reason, so. I wasn't able to record, so it doesn't matter anyway. I will like, maybe next time. We will. Um, if I can find some photos, then I'll put it in the video. But let's from the last video. Uh, um, I've not been feeling good. I. We are going to go to the ER last week, but I was like, no, not happening, whatever. My doctor gave me a week off of work last week, and now, um, I either, they might either let me go, or they might, um, fire me, just because I have chronic illness. And nobody understands it. I take the risk that I put myself into because everybody was like, oh, you need to exercise more, you need to exercise more, whatever. Listen that. Well, that's why I chose Sonic, okay, to exercise more. And then I go, well, I don't know, I go, whatever, I don't care. I did message my manager last week, but no response back. I don't know what's gonna happen. So yeah, but I did get my nose done last week. I think on Thursday, either Thursday or Friday. It might have been Thursday. It might have been Thursday. I don't really remember. I know I took a picture of it when I when I got it. So, anyways, another update. Um, I did go to the ER yesterday. Don't go. Then I go on four and a half and then I then came home like around nine o'clock ish. No, 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 it's like it was like 9 30, 9 40. I came home, so. But apparently, I was dehydrated. And my blood work and everything is fine. Good and normal. My history is good. Except I have a cyst. I might get the surgery. I probably won't find out until the 25th because that's when I see my doctor on the 25th of this month. And then I still have a lot of GI issues for my trip. Um, yeah, I still have my food on right now. I, I need to fill up my medication. I bought a new one because my other one, I left it at my boyfriend's house. So I have medicines over there too. So I have to keep taking my medicines back and forth to this house in my house. So, yeah. Oh yeah, and then my cat came back. You want to say hi, Black? My food. So, I was going to talk to my doctor about if they want me to do a second pump, if they don't want to do a second pump, then I might. 
then I might get a um then I might ask if I could do IV fluid at home again. If not, I don't know what else to do. So back in June, I was supposed to get a pull-up on my chest. But what happened was, my pulmonologist came in the room. What does it do? So I was like, I'm gonna fill it up for next week anyways. So my pulmonologist came in my room and was like, you know the risk and everything? I'm like, well yeah, I know the risk. Uh, I'm getting a pull and this and that. I'm explaining it to him. I'm like, well, I don't wanna come here, come in here. Once or twice a month, good and thick and IV fluid, and that's the only thing that hurts. So, I don't know what's gonna happen, um, but I might ask for a pick line. If they don't want to do a pull, I'm gonna ask for a pick line. I also know they work for a pick line, too, because I even had a pick line. I was trying to pick line before. Because uh, I was trying to pick line before. And I'm like, well, do you guys want me to, like, what the heck? So, sh sh no, don't you do it. Ah. Hold on, one time, hold on, one time. Don't you dare. Don't you dare do it. Got it. So, let's see what happens. Because I'm going to keep pushing for one of those two. I don't want to, I'm like, I told him, I'm like, I don't want to keep going in and out of the ER for IV fluid. And I can just do it at home. Good. And I mean, I have my supplies for it. I just can't. Nobody can poke me, okay? Not even the ER can poke me sometimes. And what are you doing? I don't know what my car is doing, but okay. But they are like, oh. Like yesterday, they brought it up. And they're like, well, we were told that you, you're not going to put I'm like, well, yeah. So, duh. And then um, they're like, what about the pick line? I'm like, well, I'm going to ask about the pick line since I was told no about the port. And then they were like, okay, well, I will continue to keep asking your doctor. I'm like, yeah, I know that. It's just frustrated. Really frustrated. Because nobody is like, oh, why didn't you just. Because I should have already had a pick line. But I don't. Because the reason why I don't is because every truth is on hold. When my doctor know, I go to the ER frequently, like once or twice a month. Well, it is once a month because of my body and the hot weather overheats my body. And I get dehydrated like really fast, only like a fist. And that's what happened. And so now it's just, I don't know what's gonna happen. Uh, I know. I'm waiting for my guy to call me back to talk to them. I do have a test, another test um, on Thursday for my GI. Uh, 
Um, I don't remember what it is. I only think I have to eat something, a tree, a rat it is. But all I know, I can't eat anything. So, and I just, well, I just put my feet back on. What do you want me to do? If I just put my feet back on. And for not eating. For a more beautiful day. And my boyfriend kept trying to make me to eat. But he knows anyway, I'm gonna go out bed. I'm not there, there's just eyes, I'm not eating. So, uh, let's see what happened. I, my neurologist, I'm gonna probably call them because, oh yeah, I'm gonna have to call his other office because my doctor isn't at the office that he's at. And he's not gonna get there to fucking the 25th, I was supposed. Don't you jump up here. So, I don't know, but I'm gonna call it as an office because I'm gonna be like, hey. So, Unless you're on vacation. Happy to party if you're on vacation, but having chronic illness is hard. Cause there'll be days I can't go out for a week, but i still going to work. And I'm looking for a new job. But it is really, really hard to find a new job because uh, why, 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 why. Because of my chronic illness, nobody doesn't want to hire anybody with disabilities. And not that, they can't fire you or do anything. And it's against the law to do that with someone who has chronic illness. Who has chronic illness. And they don't care, they don't listen, they don't give a shit about your employees. That's how work and people are. I get you can't see everybody. black because I was looking for makeup. I said, this is not a nose ring. This is an earring. I have an earring for right now because I lost my nose ring last night. I lost it last night. Don't know how. It just fell out. I looked everywhere. Can't seem to find it. So I'm going to have to ask my mom to take me to the store. So I can buy one. If not, then I can just ask my sister if I can buy one for right now till I get one. And then my time piercing are doing pretty good. Right there. Yeah. I'm pretty good. It doesn't hurt that bad anymore. It's every now and then, like, depends. But then I'm done. And then, and then so yeah. Me and my boyfriend are doing good good right now. Um, yeah. I don't know if we really really get them stuff. Uh we try to my back to edit. I don't really edit much. So everything just fall on the wall. Like, I don't know how to edit sometimes. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna watch the video and I'm probably call my other doctor's office because 
Sorry, not the other one. Thank you for calling Texas Pediatric Specialties and Family Center. This is an emergency. Please hang on. This is an up. If you know the extension, please dial it at any time. For quality and training purposes, all calls will be recorded. Mark, you know, what's going on? I have a couple of things I'm not looking for. I always tell my office to get off, but I'm lazy. I also have my thing on, and my room in the back, but that's when it's okay to tell me I... Here's my next update. Probably won't be until the end of the month because I have my test Thursday, my GI next week that I see, and my pulmonologist, which is on my car, because I was having chest pain yesterday. I the ER when I specifically told her. Mm -hmm. And I was like literally frustrated and yelling at the phone with my brother at the ER. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna upload it, and yeah, bye. And I'm about to drop my phone. And I need to call you.